Good evening, everybody, and welcome back to another spring break vlog. Now, I, I've, I've got to tell on myself here. I, I got on to Ascalon uh, for his latest unboxing video um, because it was from his March Video Games Monthly box, and he put it out in May. Um, but here we are. Here we are still doing spring break videos over a month later um, or a month after spring break. Pardon the dogs. It's crazy time around here. Um, but, but so I, I, sorry, that's just the variety we give you guys. Don't want to throw too many things back to back to back that are similar, like spacing it out for you guys that enjoy different things again. Apologize for the animals. Um, we have one more spring break vlog after the one that you are about to watch, and then that'll conclude our whole PCB series. Before we get rolling, though, I've been doing our subscriber shoutouts at the end of videos. I want to start it with one today. So our subscriber shoutout goes to Miss Shelby Miller. Shelby, thank you so much for believing in us and supporting the channel. We truly appreciate it. Uh, side note, just got done watching Shelby perform uh, in a musical, and she did fantastic. Absolutely, absolutely, absolutely loved the fact that we got to see her uh, perform and showcase her talent. So again, thank you, Shelby, for subscribing. And for everybody else, enjoy the vlog. Good morning. We are back at the All-American Diner this morning to show off that breakfast bar buffet to Jess again, or to Jess for the first time, I should say. This was Ty's favorite place to eat, so he's excited to be back. Here's a full look at the party. You've got jellies, you've got mushrooms, butter, syrup, salsa, cheese. Looks like you've got various fruit this morning. Cantaloupe, grapefruit here at the end. Oranges, I got fruit medley, apple, chocolate pudding, looks like peach slices, and then some whip spread that might be butter, got chicken tenders, and oatmeal, regular grits, cheese grits, gravy. When you got waffles, pancakes, French toast, scrambled eggs, Western scrambled eggs, which has ham and uh, cheese, and peppers, onions in it, and then biscuits in the back. And that is the full buffet. We're going to get Ty's plate made first. Here's what everybody got. I the forgot to show that. The cinnamon apples, not good. It's freezing cold. No, oh, so check you out. Cinnamon apple, biscuit gravy, piece of grapefruit, some pineapple slices, waffle, home fries, and oatmeal. Oatmeal. This, Ty, Chad didn't get the breakfast buffet the last time. He just got an omelet. Just, well, I don't know what was there, but there's scrambled eggs and home fries. Pancake. A pancake. I got a whole bowl of syrup. French waffles, toast. French toast sticks, which are gone, and home fries. I got some chicken that I've already eaten some of because they've got some great honey mustard here. Um, some sausage pieces, a couple slices of bacon that are gone, home fries, biscuit and gravy, regular scrambled eggs, waffle, and then I'm eating the rest of Jess's cheese grits that she didn't really like. And then Nana got a smorgasbord of stuff here too. Biscuit and gravy, bacon, sausage, grits, eggs. Anything you could want they have. Yep, they've got they've got just about there anything you could want up there. The king says there's not enough Mom, peanut butter on the bar for him to be happy. And then there's Marilyn again for those of y'all that did not see the other video. Who was also and, a pokey stop. Also <laughs> way yeah, I found out Marilyn is a pokey stop. Y'all can see the Skeleton Elvis and Skeleton Marilyn over there. Spooky decorations. I showed them in the previous video as well. Doing things a little different today. Starting out 
at Coconut Creek, we're gonna do the other course that we did not do last night since we're uh Yeah, we made the floor! Look <laughs> we'll yeah, there. We're on the board. Look, now it's 2.15. The, the Cokers. Yeah. 31 minutes from last night. That's look, awesome. Look guys, 15, We're at the very 15. bottom of the Ooh. board too. But there's 10, but there's a 15 and a 15. So last we are. <laughs> We were the slowest on the yeah. board. Uh -huh. Slowest on the board, <laughs> but we're on the board. At least we're on the board. Yeah. That's right. At least we're on the board. Coco Mo. I love that name. Coco Mo says welcome. We are on the course two, right here by the Grand Maze. Turtle. <laughs> There's water in the hole. There's water. There's water. Oh no, <laughs> Mr. Lizard oh, is yeah. out here watching our golf game. He's just chilling. What you think, Mr. Lizard? Is it a little hot out here today? You chilling in the shade? Oh, you should have chipped it. Yeah, chipped it. Woo. Oh. Uh, yes, yes. Hard one! Oh, man. <laughs> On a par three. It's An that eagle. One. That's crazy. Ty is already winning right now. Mr. I don't like two hole in one. And now he's got a huge lead. Oh, Ty tipped it also. Yes, yes, yes. Oh! oh. Guys. <laughs> Almost two in a row. If this wasn't a free game hole, I wouldn't have quit my wife. <laughs> At my ball. Oh, Chad. <laughs> All right, Mom, can you do it? No pressure, right? No pressure at all. <laughs> that was a good bounce. Oh. All right. It comes See dead. if Dad can do a hole-in-one here. Uh, no, nope, he already messed up. Oh, he's up. off. He messed up. What's it bouncing off of the blade? It won't. What yeah. was that? I don't know. I didn't come anywhere close. Ah! <laughs> oh. Ah! So close. Let him talk to you. Three yes. hole in ones for Ty. Look at the cougar. We got water. Watch out, This is how close Ty got to a hole in one go forward, go on the forward. free game hole. They're trying to blow in. <laughs> yes! Hole in one! It would have been his fourth a hole in one. I'm counting it. Another neat thing about Coconut Creek, they give coupons in the scorecard, so a dollar off their t-shirts, two dollars off their pay one price, which we got for the next time you come and want to do it, so that could save you some money as well. Show you guys how things went. Ty played the game of his life, 48, oh wait, never mind, that is yesterday's, he got a 41. Okay, as you can see, he beat all of us. Wait, I got 41? And I was the next closest at a 45. He beat me by four strokes. Grand total, totaling course one from last night and course two. Wait, I had an 87 and he had an 89. So I only beat him by two strokes. Unbelievable. Here's Ty and his wood nickel for his hole in one on the free game hole. Wind assisted. But four hole in ones in total in that round. Best round for any of us this whole trip. We're back out at the pool. Gonna save Ty's free game for some other time. Wanted to get back out here. It's a little overcast. Um, I don't know if I mentioned this already this morning or not, but we're all fairly burnt in different areas. Jess and myself 
more so than the boys. Um, so she didn't want to head down to the beach today because she knew we'd fry and wouldn't be able to go tomorrow. And so I think she's wanting to go tomorrow since tomorrow's going to be our last day. So out here hanging by the pool, Ty is going to try his best again to catch the football. He's probably O for about 35 or 36 after yesterday. But after all its hole-in-ones, I bet he's feeling lucky and pretty confident. So we'll see. Happy birthday, Miss Danny. We were only at the pool for about an hour due to everybody being kind of burnt, which stinks for sure. And as much as Chad loves golf, Ty loves going to the arcade. So we decided we'd go ahead and get ourselves changed and come back to the Rocket Lanes Arcade because this is the one that Ty loved the most, the one that we did the afternoon before I went and picked mom up. So we're gonna be back here and we'll be here for a little while before we head to dinner tonight. Spin the wheel, Ty. It says for you to spin it. You haven't really spun it, so throw it down. Twenty-five. It was on four. Oh! Does that count? Does that count? No. Spin the wheel, Ty. Okay. Spin it. You gotta spin it. Oh, there you go. Is it? Yes! Yay! <laughs> Woo! Dad with a hundo! Dad coming in clutch there. Oh, hundred Dad tickets. Yep. And Dad just did. <laughs> They're going to play a little Bass Dominion. I smash it. <laughs> Dad is killing the four minions. Time's up. Time's up. 21. 21. Chad's playing Pop the Lock. Ty likes this one too, but he hasn't played it yet. Oh. Nobody won anything on the giant claw machine. I didn't film it, so if you're curious about uh, what the giant claw was like, you'll have to go catch our video of the last time we were here. Mom got in on the ski ball action now. I'd say they're doing pretty good. 200 point score. Chad will play this game. Them early, folks, at the arcade playing the sink it game. Chad was pretty darn good at this the other day, so it was Ty. Ty's got six cups. Got one. Get ready to go. 
did all right there. For those that didn't see the other video here at Rocket Lanes, they do have a full skating rink, giving off the very late 80s, early 90s feel. Gotta love that. And then on the other side of the arcade here, you can kind of see it, of course, what the namesake is, lots and lots and lots of bowling alleys. But our kids have made it back to the small claw where they're trying to win tickets because, of course, it's all about the tickets. Hey, everybody, we're done with the arcade. Uh, we've actually stopped at Walgreens so Jess could run in and grab a few things. Um, after the arcade, which Chad got some kind of little squishy pet that I think he's holding. And then uh, aside from that, the boys just got candy. Ty got a lot of candy. Um, we made a stop at Sonic for some afternoon drinks. That's why my mouth looks a little blue. Uh, I got an ocean water. Thanks, Joshua, for the tip there. It's very good. I got it too. And Chad got an ocean water too. Ty got a Powerade slushy. And Jess got my old staple, the good old strawberry fresh fruit slush, which is fantastic as well. So uh, we're hydrating, we're cooling off. Um, we're probably gonna go back to the condo for about an hour, um, maybe a little more. And then we're gonna head to another Panama City Beach staple, um, Captain Anderson's for dinner. And I don't know if I've ever eaten at Captain Anderson's, in all the years that I've been coming down here. Um, but even if I have, it's been very, very, very long time since I have. Jess, uh, when she used to come down here with her mom on vacation, they used to eat there every single time. And I know for a fact that even though they did that since she and I have been coming down here, we've never eaten there. So time to take the boys because they've never been time to take me because i've never been and you guys can come along with us so that's probably where you're going to see us next in this video is uh going into captain well just had a change of plans when she came out of walgreens she said why don't we head to one of those surf style places which is just one of panama city's tourist shops for the most part so we're going to go in and we're going to take a look around Walk right in and bombarded with surf style spring break gear. They've got sunglasses. T-shirts. They've got outdoor stuff. They've got t-shirts galore. Kids in the back there, men's, women's, souvenirs, shoes, sandals, airbrush t-shirts, swimsuits, pool toys, everything you could imagine. They have fairly decent deals, as you can see, by three get one free on these t-shirts youth and adult over here with kids souvenir shirts though they're eight dollars each <laughs> if you buy three or more chad has become fascinated with these squishy cups everywhere we go he, he loves he loves them a report about turtles in school and they've got them in mug style I found another release, the Kraken shirt. And these, this is one of those oh, like cool, cool down type shirts, performance feel. Wonder how much it is. Uh, let's see here, $35, a little steep. Funny socks, dad socks usually aren't this funny but these are fantastic first you've got flamingos so tampa j come get your socks yeah. but you got harry otter yeah. you got dadalorian you've got pack baby with the stormtroopers there another harry otter and i love these down here you have darth brooks tupaca and chili nelson Needless to say, we had some laughs over here looking at the socks. We left Surf Style across the street. We got us a few shirts to wear for some pictures we're gonna do on the beach. And we are right across the street at Alvin's Island. And Alvin's Island used to be the place if you wanted to do some tourist shopping here in PCB. There was only one Alvin's Island location. 
and it was over near the Miracle Strip, which is also no longer here, unfortunately. That was the theme park. But now there are a couple of Alvin's Island locations here in PCB, and we are just gonna hit one up and see what they've got. Oh, Chad found some sloths. Some sloths, yeah, the Chad sloths go about right, Chad's sloth. speed. What is this? Which is not fast. And then we got dolphins, and we got turtles. Alrighty, so as promised, we are done shopping. We went back to the condo for about a half hour, and now we are at Captain Anderson's for dinner. Again, I don't think I have ever eaten here in my 30 plus years of coming down here. Jess used to come all the time with her mom. And so we're gonna, this is the first time for me, it's the first time for the boys. And we'll see how this goes. As you can see, there's a crowd already just waiting to get in. So we'll see what this mad rush is like, just trying to get in to get seated here. Walk in and see a giant fish on the wall. Pictures. It's got a really awesome nautical feel in here. Really, really, really cool decor. The wine closet. The book of all the wines they've got out there. Really neat. Hey there, how are you? We're doing great. Another camo. They've got a digital menu. Tons and tons and tons of awesome, awesome stuff on the wall and around. A couple of cannons. Look, lucky for you, me and Feta better found this hell cow on. Oh, look, there's Miss Georgia. Miss Georgia. <laughs> Here's the appetizers. Was that good, boy? That was a good joke. Soup and salad. Sorry about the sunburst there. Chicken and pasta. You've got upgrade enhancements. Fresh from the Gulf seafood, including their famous seafood platter. You've got salmon, shrimp, grouper. You've got fried seafood right here. Yeah. Uh, open hearth, okay, open hearth, Greek style, different types of fish. And then you've got your steak options. Side orders, again, I apologize for the sunburst. They put us right here with the marina to our backs. You got champagnes and wines specialty cocktails, premium bottled water, all different kinds of drinks. And here are specific drink selections for you. And then I'll show you all the kids menu. There's the kids menu. Ty says he's getting steak. Wonderful. <laughs> and there's sweets and treats down there. Here's a look at the main dining room. Like you're inside the whole of the ship. At least it gives me that feel. We have our salad. I got a house salad with Thousand Island. So did Nana. And you can see we also have bread service at the table. Is the butter on it? Not yet. A couple different kinds of bread. And then Jessica had a house salad with ranch. With butter. This is our what we're dealing with. We just have a cedar plank salmon. <laughs> Chad's already eating. With baked potato. <laughs> Chad got grilled cheese and french fries with some honey mustard. They brought out some hush puppies for the table. <laughs> Ty ordered a kid's sirloin steak, and so it's almost done. So it'll probably be out here in a second. And he got french fries. 
Nana got a grilled churrasco steak and it's underneath that huge pile of onion somewhere. And she got a baked potato. And then I got my absolute favorite thing in the world, bar none, sauteed crab claws. And there are very, very, very few places down here that I can get these. And so I typically am only able to get them about once a trip. So very, very, very excited for this meal. And I got a side of collard greens. There is Chad or Ty's uh, kids' sirloin steak. It looks really, really good. We'll see how much of it he eats. Tonight, Ty wanted to come back to the arcade here at Cobra. So we're hitting up our second arcade today. Let's see what they want to do. I guess more claw machine. Oh, hey, hey, I get yeah, Chad got 10. Oh, yeah, Ty got 16. They got 16 to 3 now. They know we're too good. This, yeah, this was 1 when we came the other day. Now this is 3. And welcome back. I hope you guys enjoyed that vlog. As y'all can tell, another fun-filled day in Panama City. We got to do a little shopping. We went to a couple of arcades for the boys, and we had dinner at Captain Anderson's, which again, place that I've never eaten at before, but it was terrific. It definitely lived up to all of the hype that I had heard. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like down below as it goes a long way to help our channel. If you have any questions, comments, etc., again, drop those down below as we love interacting with you guys. And if you're just stumbled upon us and you enjoyed the content, please think about hitting that subscribe button. We're trying to reach 500 subscribers by the end of 2023, and we are super close to 400. So please think about uh, hitting that button and maybe turning on your notifications so that you never miss an episode of Coker Culture, because like I said at the beginning, never know what you're going to get here. Until next time, what's your why?